Have you ever considered trying acupuncture to treat an ailment or injury? Well, I had the chance to sit down with an acupuncture therapist to find out more about the benefits of this alternative medicine. Has your doctor ever prescribed you a round of acupuncture for an ailment? Chances are the answer is no, but more and more physicians are turning to alternative treatments from everything from headaches to obesity. Here today to explain some of the benefits of acupuncture treatment is Dr. Suzanne Swearingen of Alternative Health Clinic. Thank you for your time. Thank you. My all right, pleasure. so I know nowadays there's all kinds of types, different types of acupuncture. Explain some of them and the process. Well, the, the most uh, common one you see is traditional Chinese medicine acupuncture where they use the very fine filament type needles. But there's also what they call battlefield acupuncture or another term for it is rapid results acupuncture. Mm -hmm. And that's where they use semi-permanent needles and they are actually just applied to the ear points. Mm -hmm. And they can stay in for a period of several days to continue the benefit of the acupuncture that way. Mm -hmm. And there's also acupuncture injection therapy where we use natural substances such as a vitamin or um, a homeopathic medication or saline to stimulate the acupuncture point uh, again for a prolonged period of time but also adds a benefit to the area that mm. way. So what are some of the most common reasons why people would see an acupuncturist? Most commonly it's pain that yeah. now in our society but there are some other things that we treat one is uh, mental emotional issues, um, digestive issues, sleep problems, uh, and then hormonal issues such as menopause, that's mm -hmm. another one that we um, see. Yeah, I know anxiety is a big one there. Um, if you're on medication for anxiety, is it something that you can come off of? Uh, with your doctor's help, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Okay. If there's a transition there, but absolutely. Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, food-related issues, mm -hmm. is that a big one there too? Uh, yes, but mostly you're going to have to make dietary changes to help your system uh, overcome that, but absolutely. Okay, and weight loss and obesity, I know this is a big yeah. one too. Weight, weight loss is one of those where it can help with the cravings and it can help with the appetite control, uh, but you know, I had a quote from someone that was a mentor of mine, he says, if you continue to do the same, you will only get the same. Mm -hmm. So it helps with that transition of making those dietary and lifestyle changes so that you can lose the weight and keep it off, right. but it makes it easier. Certainly. Okay. And so if you see an acupuncturist, how long after um, will you start to feel the effects and see the benefits? Generally within 12 to 24 hours, but sometimes it can take up to, um, you know, four treatments to really turn the corner and, and feel the, okay. the benefits and see that light at the end of the tunnel. Yeah, so you do need to come back. It's not just a one-time thing. Not generally. Yeah. Okay. The, the longer you have an issue, the longer it generally takes to go away. But if something just happened, one or two treatments will usually take care of it. All right, so it sounds like a lot of great benefits here, but there are some side effects. We're going to talk about that in the second segment. Okay, thank you.